Inserting a template in the We Agree wizard may involve copy-paste work. We've developed a document upload functionality which has automated this copy-pasting. In this video, we'll show you how to upload your model contract in just a few clicks. What the upload functionality will do is upload the entire Word document paragraph by paragraph. It will strip automated clause numbering, extra line breaks inserted as white space between paragraphs, and it will remove cross-references, tables and pictures. If clauses were not automatically numbering, you need to remove all clause numbers and enumerations yourself before importing the Word document. Before you import your Word document, you need to delete those parts that will come in as part of your contract house style or which are already available in your clause library. Accordingly, remove the cover page, a table of contents and building blocks such as the parties block, the signature block, the boilerplate miscellaneous clauses and clause library clauses such as dispute resolution, confidentiality and force majeure. Save your document in the docx office format not the Word 97 2003 format with a doc file name extension. Click Insert Template and enter the details of the template and its accompanying information as they are to appear on the new contract page. Tick the box Automated Import. In the dialog screen that appears after saving the template carrier, you need to upload your model contract, the Word document you just cleaned up. After loading the Word document, the We Agree wizard has pre-formatted the clauses. Before you actually import the template, correct the pre-formatting set by the We Agree wizard. First of all, change the article headings and desired Q&A stops to level 1. Similarly, change any sub-paragraphs and enumerations to the appropriate indentation levels 3, 4 or exceptionally 5. These buttons will align the template clauses in the template outline as you want them to appear on the left side in the questionnaire and template creation tool. Note that by clicking the buttons, the related paragraph styling is adjusted as well. The styling is adjusted to what is commonly done. Correct the paragraph styling as necessary. To assign a name to the components in the template outline, the import tooling uses the caption or first few words of the clause. Correct these component names as desired. There is no need to convert the captions as well. If you have the component names right, converting the captions into tags will be very easy by using the Insert Caption tooling later on. You are now ready to polish your template. Click Import Contract. It may take a minute to import and structure the entire document. After importing, the We Agree wizard will bring you to the Template Creation tool, where you'll be prompted to insert the template settings. Here you can include the cover page and table of contents. In the template itself, you can insert the relevant clauses from the clause library. Let me give you a few tips to further speed up template insertion. If you want to upload several clauses for the clause library, you can do so by importing a Word document in which they are all collected. Upload the document as a template and from within the template, in the Template Creation tool, you can upgrade the individual clauses to the clause library. If you want to upload schedules or annexes, you may include them as part of a template and within the Template Creation tool, cut and paste them into the annex. Note that this functionality is still work in progress. Once you start using it, additional tasks may have been automated as well. At the time of recording this tutorial, automatically uploading definitions, schedules and annexes, tables and pictures was not yet possible. We'll introduce this step by step. 